Hi, so I'm going to show you how to create um, a drop down list, and that is using both Google Sheets and Excel, is pretty much the same. I've just got a spreadsheet set up here called Spreadsheet. So, status is where we're going to have our drop down box. So, in order to do a drop down menu, um, you can do several things. So, what I'm going to do is I'm going to create an extra tab and I'm going to call it Do Not Use. Okay, and then I'm going to have my drop down list in here. And you can have one sheet for multiple lists, or you can use this sheet and you can put them somewhere that you're not going to use and just hide it away, or even leave it open and just put Do Not Use above it. Data validation, you can call it Office Use Only. So, in here, I'm going to have status. So, I'm going to have current owner. Let's say it's a gym, so um, day pass only, elite. Instead of current, we'll have regular, and then we'll have VIP, and then we'll have free student access. Okay, in order to get the drop down bet box, so what I want to do is I want to make these options in here. So, I highlight this, I'm going to go to data. Um, it's very similar in um, Excel, so I'm going to go data validation and then I'm going to go, so that's the cell range, it's, I've already highlighted it so it's there. If I hadn't already highlighted, what I could do is just click into it and then highlight it. Um, list from range, so that is, it is list from range that I want, or I can do list of items and type it in, but if you do it this way, if you change this list, it's going to change here. So that's good. On, so we're going to have it to reject input if it doesn't. So it has to, it's locked. It can only be one of those fields when we do it this way. Okay, list from range. And the range, you're going to click in this box. And then you're going to, once you clicked into this box, it's waiting for you to tell it what, what the list is. So I'm going to go to here. And this is my list. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to do this. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to do an extra five, just in case later on. I decide, do you know what? I forgot a few types of memberships. Oh, we might introduce a new type of membership. So, and then I'm going to save that. Now, as you can see, everything in these fields, now you can do the whole Basically, column. Basically, that's it in a nutshell. If you want to learn any more about this or how to do the full column, how to change it and everything else, follow me and I'll post some more updates later on. Thank you.